India and the state government of Sikkim. We have jointly organized this today's workshop on Soharikpa. And the delegates, research scholars, and the faculty members and practitioners from the different parts of the country, they are attending in this very, very important today's workshop. And as you know, Honorable Prime Minister Narendra Modi ji is always putting his best possible effort to promote the traditional system of medicine. And now, because of his untiring effort, dynamic initiative, now the Ayus, all system involved in the Ayus, every system is prospering, whether it is Ayurveda, Siddha, Yunani, Soharikpa, Yoga, Nasarapati, and Homeopathy. So now, because of our, of our performance, now the WHO has set up their Global Center for Traditional Medicine in Jamnagar, Gujarat, India. This is the first of its kind by WSO. This is the biggest recognition given to our traditional system of medicine. And it is happening only because of our Honorable Prime Minister Narendra Modi ji. Because of his untiring effort, continuous support and continuous initiative he has taken so far in the last eight years of his regime. Now India is achieving this tallest success. So I believe that's the way we are promoting our system of medicine, traditional system of medicine. And because of our ability and efficiency, we could able to create and also develop the trust and confidence in the mindset of the global society. And as a result, the IUS industry has created more than 18.2 US billion dollar market in the world. That is why it is day by day it is growing its popularity. In the near future, this Sikkim in the sector of Soharikpa is definitely going to uh, become one of the leading state and leading sport of the world. And I believe whatever like you know numbers of tourists that travel to uh, Sikkim, this particular component is also going to attract them in a bigger scale. And I am sure that like uh, this particular traditional medicine will definitely play a big role in the prevention of disease and preservation of human health in the world.